searching it twice to stay in the same room where you're posing as someone already? Well, I'm familiar with the neighborhood, so should help us save some time. Everyone knows me here. Well, that's good. I mean, you know, if we're careful, we talk to the right people, then maybe they can help us find your sister. Well, your good friend Jason doesn't even believe I have a sister. Well, it's irrelevant. We just need to find Megan and get the hell back to Port Charles. Well, it's all good and well, Lucky. Somewhere in that heart, you're probably wondering if you can believe a word I say. I trust you, Siobhan. I mean, that's... That's why I'm here. That's why I risked my job sneaking you out, having everyone believe you're still in police custody. There's no way for me to prove anything I've told you. Why, why, why do you keep doing this? I mean, you can't prove anything. That's what trust is. Sometimes it completely flies in the face of what appears to be true. Trusting people isn't safe, Siobhan. Believe me, I know that from experience. But I... I don't know how else to live. Maybe I don't want you risking your life for me. You've risked yours for me. You started from when I was pretending to be Ronan O'Reilly, and... And then recently you've been trying to convince the Balkan that my life isn't expendable? You know, it's funny, when we were here before, and I was undercover, I was more honest with you than I'd been with anyone in years. And whatever happened between us then, that's... that's what brought us together. I trust that feeling. So I trust you. I needed to hear that. Thank you. Okay. I need to come up with a plan to find your sister and get back to Port Charles before the Balkan figures out that we're gone. It pains me to admit that we both allowed ourselves to be deceived. So the arrest was fake. You look real to me. I imagine the detective surprised Ms. McKenna so that her outrage would appear convincing. Then he somehow spirited her away. And I waited for hours, risking permanent spinal damage on the so-called chairs of the police department. And of course, no one expects to see her for the next 48 hours as she is theoretically in police custody. <laughs> you have to admit, it was a pretty smooth maneuver. The detective and his bonny lass are proving to be worthy adversaries. And so the final outcome will be all the more satisfying. We used to go to the Aran Islands, the lot of us when we were growing up. The ferries leave from Rossville. Mm -hmm. You can hear the bells for about three blocks. Are there buildings along the water? There's some old warehouses. Megan must be in one of them. Okay. Okay, we should, uh, we should run a surveillance and then regroup and go find her. Well, I need to meet up with an old friend first. I'll put in a call or two. He'll be easy enough to find. What are you talking about? You don't expect me to go after my sister unarmed. Unless you slipped another police revolver through security. You, you can't you buy a own. gun off the street in Galway. It's too dangerous. Well, I'm not going to get kidnapped by the Vulcan stocks again. I need to be able to defend myself. Siobhan, you can't go into this waving a gun around, okay? Why not? I imagine the detective and his bonny lass are in Galway by now. It's never a good idea to make assumptions. <laughs> they outmaneuvered me once, but they will end up exactly where I want them to be. And now isn't the time to get overconfident. It makes you careless. <laughs> Do I appear to be a careless man? I think we lost him. Well, if we were even being followed. No, I'm pretty sure we were. One of the guys who was with your gun connection got a pretty good look at my face right before I ducked into that little store. Well, then we better get out before word gets around. Hey. You okay? Do you see all the hearts and flowers out there? 
Megan loves Valentine's Day. She's scared. Lucky. She's wondering where I am. She's... She's dependent on me. Hey, listen, listen. We're so close. We're here, you know? We're gonna find her, okay? You even know how to use that thing? Better hope so. Look, this is no way to save your sister. So I won't risk Megan's life on you going in alone. It's what I'm trained for. Listen to me, Lucky. I got Megan into this mess. I'll kick in the door and shoot the bastards who are holding her with or without you, so don't you dare try to stop me. Our employer said to be ready for years. Nice work, Miss McKenna. <laughs>